So now we'll take a little tour of our OTA lab space. So we spend a lot of time in our classes um, teaching a lot of hands-on um, practical activities that you would do. Um, so again, OTAs deal with function. So we're always looking at how are you doing getting in and out of bed, getting in and out of the bathroom, the shower, um, the kitchen, all of those kind of things. Um, so here we kind of have a bed set up. Um, we have the bed set up with some um, side rails and some arm rails that would help people enable get in and out of bed and help them roll if they needed that so we can teach students how to use that. Um, we have several different wheelchairs available. We teach a lot of wheelchair positioning if individuals are not able to do um, their functional mobility um, or ambulation to be able to walk without a device. We teach a lot of wheelchair positioning. Um, over in this area, we have a simulated bathroom set up with a lot of different equipment options, a raised toilet seat, some bars. Um, a tub, a shower that we can practice transfers in, a variety of different transfer benches, just all kind of adaptations we can make. So over here we have some different, just some different modalities set up that OTAs will interact with in their day-to-day um, -day careers. We have a paraffin bath that we would use, um, a hydroculator or a hot tap machine that we would use to provide heat to our clients, um, and a fluidotherapy machine. So this is helpful for again for heat or for scar management and things like that. Um, over here, we kind of move into our simulated kitchen setup. So we have a stove, a refrigerator, a microwave, a coffee pot, kind of all the things that you would use um, in your day to day life, right? In your normal kitchen, we have our cabinet stocked with some things so that we can work on getting things in and out of the cabinets if you would have a disability or things like that. Um, you see our desks are a little different here in the OTA department. They're actually massage tables because we use these in class um, for assessing range of motion and teaching how to assess range of motion and strength as well as different transfer techniques and things like that.